How did you find that today? Yeah, I really enjoyed it out there. I think that we've had a, a good few games we've been really building, and it's nice to win that uh, trophy to start the season. Yeah, start the season nice yeah I was going to say, even, even lifting a trophy when it's mm -hmm. a pre-season thing like that, it just kind of gives a bit of a winning mentality. Yeah, of course. It just builds confidence at the end of the day. Like We've already got that winning mentality. We want to go and push on and do well, and that just gives us a bit of confidence to take it into the season. Really. How are you feeling about the minutes that you've had since you've been here? Yeah, it's been really positive. Like I came into pre-season not really expecting not expecting anything, just work hard and see what happens. And I've come out with a lot of minutes, so it's been really good, really positive. What's the manager had to say to you? Um, I think he's just been uh, helping me. He's been giving me little details. He's been uh, telling me that he's happy with me, so I'm just going to keep working. And for you young guys at Chelsea now, is there an opening there to sort of make your mark in the, in the team? Yeah, of course. I feel like you've always got to have that uh, mentality of whether things are going on above you, whether players are being signed. You've just got to always be pushing and trying do your best to work your way in there. Do you know what the plan is for you this coming season? I think for me it's just about developing, keep working hard, keep developing. Right now I've just been enjoying my time here and we'll just see what happens. Getting your hands on the trophy? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> is, is there a possibility you could go out on loan? I think we're just going to have to see what happens right now. But I've just been enjoying my time at Chelsea, so we'll work from there, yeah. And, and for, for someone who's been around the club for a while, do you kind of almost, even though you're young yourself, you kind of pass on your experience and your knowledge of the club to some of these new, new lads coming in? Yeah, I hope so. Like I've been on the phone to the under-21s coach. He wants me to pass on a little bit of that to kind of keep the connection there. So it's really nice, yeah. Brilliant. How Thanks. special is to play uh, with a player with a World Cup champion like Enzo Fernandez? Oh, yeah, Enzo is top. I, I haven't known him so long, only a few weeks, because he joined a little bit later. But he's a really friendly guy. And I was joking with him the other day that every time I have the ball, he's always in front of me. So he's always giving me options to play. Another Argentinian, the coach, Mauricio Pochettino, have you learned already anything with him this, during these weeks? Yes, definitely. We, we've been working a lot on tactics and our shape off the ball and defensively, so I've been learning a lot. And obviously, he was a centre-back in his playing days. So. As a young player, what's your expect, expectations for, uh, for the new season? I think that my expectation is that I just have to work hard and uh, try my best to impress the manager and see what happens. Another central defender, Thiago Silva, mm -hmm. one of the experienced guys. Any, any work with him? Uh, yeah. <laughs> He might find me a little bit annoying sometimes because I'm always trying to get a little bit of information off of him, but he's, he's top. He's always telling me, Bash, go here, move there, wait to pass or pass now. So it's always helping me. So thank you very much. Thanks, I appreciate it. Yeah, thank you very Cheers, much. Thanks,